Traveling again to Quickies. This is Ted. Today I'm here today with another uh, newcomer to this ATL Wood scene, Mr. Jacob Sumdi. So, Jacob, what got you into film work in the first place? Uh, I started off working in haunt attractions, and um, I was doing set dressing, uh, props, gags, a lot of special effects work. Um, and while I was also I had to go out into the hallways and repair things when people would freak out and lose their minds, would break things, rip things off the wall. So I was out there so often that they decided to put a mask on me, and one thing led to another. When I wasn't chasing children with an electric drill, I was nailing things to the wall. And I seemed to catch on to it. <laughs> Would we find you on IMDb? Yeah, actually, if you look for Jacob Somdi, you'll find me there. I don't know what my ranking is, but I also don't believe in that internet black magic PowerPoint thing. So, uh, do you prefer acting in film or theater or both, or what? I like film um, because you have multiple opportunities to get that one shot. Um, I like theater because it's a lot more in your face and spontaneous, and how the audience reacts directly feeds back to how you react. So I like them both, but honestly, I like film because I'm a little bit more of a perfectionist. Uh, what's been your favorite role so far and why? Um, I'd have to say my favorite role would be Darren Coleman from Test Grip, the movie. He plays a sociopath guard for a large pharmaceutical company. And the character is very dark, very deep, and very troubled. And I'm the complete opposite. I'm pretty lighthearted and shallow. So I, I like doing things that I normally want to do out in the real world. So what do you think of Atlanta becoming the next Hollywood? I'm ready for it. I think everyone else needs to learn how to be ready for it. Um, it's at the beginning of a brand new style of industry. Um, we're on ground floor to do some amazing things and help out other people. And I think if we're really diligent about embracing a lot of the independent style and idea, I think we can make a lot of amazing things happen around the world. So what are you doing right now film work wise? Um, I am currently in pre-production for a fan film based off of a vintage 70s horror comic book. Um, hopefully I'll get that out for Halloween, cross your fingers. I'm involved in a uh, Battletech fan film, which is nice. Once again, I play some psycho bad guy. What would you be doing right now if you weren't acting? You know, if I was in front of the camera, I'd probably be behind it. I get the opportunity to be a director and assistant director every once in a while on a lot of these new features, and uh, I, I love being behind it. I will do that all day long. So who would you say are your Hollywood no, filmmaking like heroes? Actually, I think it would be those uh, those directors that really broke out and came from nothing. So I'd have to say first order of business would be Robert Rodriguez, uh, Quentin Tarantino, James Cameron. I'm a huge fan of him. Uh, anyone who just comes out of nowhere with something new and amazing. That's what I'd like. That's, that's my hero right there. Right. Any particular Hollywood people you'd like to work with in the future? Uh, well, those influences I would definitely like to work with. But uh, yeah, Rosario Dawson, call me immediately. So where do you see yourself years from now? What are your plans for the future? I would hope that uh, I got in at the right time in this new industry with the uh, new Hollywood. And I'm hoping that I get in myself in a position where I can help other people who are in this position that I'm in. So, I mean, what's the point of having success unless you're sharing it with friends, right? <laughs> So, that said, anything to leave us with? Any uh, movies, websites, or anything to plug? Um, just a bit of advice. If you want to be seen, get out there. No one will ever see you unless you put yourself up front. Um, keep moving forward. Uh, keep a positive attitude. It'll get you farther than you think. And, um, yeah, let me plug uh, my artwork, because when I'm not an actor or director, I also do a lot of paint and illustration. And you can just go search for Art of Crowface with a K on Facebook. The URL is probably down there somewhere. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Jacob. Thank Sunday. you so much. Thank you so much, Ted. Absolutely. Thank you. This is Ted. This is Quickies. Have a good day. Bye-bye. <laughs>